Hey, what's up, guys? New release Wednesday. And uh, you can see I got the best release of them all, which is a roll of toilet paper. Yeah, I live in New York. Uh, not New York City, upstate, actually, near Albany. And my local card shop is Finnegan Sports Cards. And uh, he is currently shut down, but doing curbside and giving a roll of toilet paper away with every purchase. So I think that's pretty funny and pretty awesome because... Um, this stuff's really hard to get in New York right now. So, I mean, that might be my best card right there. It might be a $10 card. So, <laughs> the, uh, the, the new releases today are, uh, Gypsy Queen. Gypsy Queen, Gypsy Queen. I got two boxes. I'm going to do a video for each box. And the first opening, I'm also going to open Inception because I have not opened that yet this year. So, let's get right into it so I don't bore your socks off. Um, a lot of stuff going on today. They're talking about the, the, uh, baseball season. Man, I would kill for some sports right now. Like, I've been playing, uh, MLB The Show 2020 and just like, man, I just wish the season would start. But, you know, just like everybody else, gotta wait for it. Um, I don't care if they do a shortened season. I don't care if there's a messed up playoff structure. I just want to see some baseball. So, hopefully, that will happen sometime this year. Um, the hobby news is that Beckett, I have a, I pointed over there, like you guys can see what's going on right there. Uh, I have a, the new Beckett baseball right there. Beckett shut down yesterday for, um, because they're in Texas and it was a mandated order to do so. So it looks like it's going to be pretty tough to get your Beckett submissions back anytime soon as if they weren't already overloaded. Uh, other industry news would be that Tops Series 2 and Update is going to be a little weird this year uh, because those products are full of rookies and uh, trades and stuff, and that is just not happening right now. Okay, my dog is going apeshit bananas in the other room. Uh, you got to understand, my dog is like 6 inches tall and 10 pounds, but... Whatever. All right, let's take a look at Inception. We got a Matt Theis rookie, Chris Paddock. Now, people either love or hate these cards. I'm in the love section of these cards. I think they're awesome. Um, I think they look great. If you haven't checked them out yet, I know they've been out for a week, but uh, the supply just came in here to New York because, you know, I live in New York and it's all messed up here. Um, very slick looking cards to me. I like the artistic design. We got a Devers. Let's see. We got an, oh, we might have got a patch auto here. Oh boy. A red Vladdy Guerrero Jr. to 75. Awesome. That is a good hit. If he ever plays this year. Um, let's see. What is that behind it? There's two hits in this box? There are two hits in this box. Then we got a Yamamoto rookie to 75 patch. Well, it's not really a patch. It's just Jersey auto, but two hits in an inception box. Uh, I have not seen that happen yet. So that is pretty rare. This Vladdy Jr. is sick. Oh boy, I don't have any. This is the other problem about everything being shut down. I forgot to ask for thick penny sleeves, so going to have to slice up the side here and make do until I'm able to get into the shop. So there's that Vladdy to 75 Now these boxes generally go for anywhere from $60 to $70. Um, like you only get a certain amount of cards and it was a six cards. Don't count on ever getting two hits in this box. This is an anomaly and uh, a pretty awesome one at that. I don't even know if this Yamamoto is going to, this Yamamoto is thick. No, it goes in. All right, there's the Yamamoto. Very awesome. Then we got our parallels, a Robel Garcia to 99, rookie, and Willie Castro, green parallel. So uh, a very awesome box of Inception right there. Very happy with that. Um, was not expecting two hits because that, I've watched a ton of videos and I just haven't seen that happen. So we're going to move on to the Gypsy Queen. Now, I got to be honest with you guys. I have not opened very much Gypsy Queen in the past. Uh, 
I'm not quite 100% sure what we're going to be looking at here. So if I miss something, please let me know in the comments. I know there's a ton of different parallels in here. These are going to be three of the Chrome cards that you get inside every hobby box. And we'll save that one for the last. I'm going to go ahead and take the packs out of the box. So yeah, getting back to the industry news. Uh, Tops, what are they going to do for Series 2 and update this year? Is there going to be a Series 2 and up? I'm sure there's going to be a Series 2, but is it going to be an update this year? That is the big question. All right, so in Gypsy Queen, you're guaranteed two autos per box on card. Uh, love that. These boxes generally go for anywhere between $100 to $110. And uh, there's also, you'll find them in great supply and retail in your Target and your Walmart. So let's take a look. That's a great way to start right there with the Mike Trout. Uh, the back of the cards look like this. So you can see no stats really. We got a Munoz rookie. And then a fortune teller. I believe these are one in every six or eight packs. And that is going to be Paul DeJong. So nice insert there. Got a Harvey rookie. Muncie. L.A. So there's Jackie Robinson uh, parallels. And you'll... The parallels are kind of hard to see. So if I if I pass one, please let me know uh, in the comments. I would greatly appreciate it. Uh, the Jackie Robinson, for instance, will have the player wearing the number 42, like a patch on his jersey. And uh, the Players' Day weekend should be a little bit more obvious with uh, a different kind of jersey. We've got Anthony K. rookie. Adames. Got a Jordan Alvarez. Tarot of the Diamond. Very awesome. So today is starting out pretty good. It looks like a playing card. You can see the rounded corners. That's what the back looks like. So Alvarez, Tarot of the Diamond. Leave that one right there. That's definitely a cool looking card. And we got uh, J.D. Martinez. <laughs> and a... Luis Robert, rookie card. Freaking sick. I'm, uh, I'm having a pretty good, pretty good rip here already, and I'm like three packs in. Okay. We're going to finish that out with Mr. Reese Hoskins. There are books, I believe, in Gypsy Queen. They are very rare. Like uh, number to 10 or less. There's an Aquino rookie. Brown rookie. Elzele rookie. A Bichette rookie. And Dozier. All right. So, Luis Robert. Jordan Alvarez and a Quino rookie uh, right off in the first couple of packs here. So very awesome. I pulled these out of a freshly opened case. I was able to choose my boxes. Uh, I picked the second box from each left and right side. And our first autograph is going to be Mr. Austin Meadows. Not the best auto, but an auto nonetheless on card. And uh, that's what the back looks like. Got another Alzale. Uh, Austin Meadows and a Santander. To be honest, I'm more psyched about the Luis Robert rookie card than I am the Austin Meadows autograph. Sorry, Austin. Nola rookie. Eldredton Simmons. This is one per box. It is going to be the short print. And these cards are numbered, I believe, 300 through 320. This is Roberto Clemente, and that's card number 308.
Sinsu Ju. Don't know how to say this guy's name yet. Demerit. And a Gavin Lux. G2. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm like, what? Uh, it's G Lux, second base, shortstop. All right, got it. Well, I'm pretty pretty psyched with what I got so far. Um, I don't know what else is left in this box. Nola Escobar, Web Rookie, Alfaro, Williams, Blackman, Braun, and Kettle Marte. Yelly means Guerrero Jr., Chapman, Scherzer, Duffy, Sterling Marte, and Grendahl. Oops. All right, we got a Heaney. Longoria, Guzman, a Zuch, Zook, Zook for the Blue Jays rookie, a fortune teller of Chavez, Matt Olson, Polanco, and Jalen Davis rookie. Boyd, Abreu, Matt, Rizzo. Rendon, Bell, Hazley, and Chris Davis. So we've hit a little bit of a slowdown here. I've only pulled one rookie out of the past three or four packs after pulling all the rookies out of the first four packs. Marvell, rookie. Barrios, Yaz, Allen, rookie. Cabrera, Bregman, Diaz rookie, and Calhoun. Dansby, Fernandez rookie, Lindor, Zach Collins rookie, Urena, Pujols, Dunn rookie and Sanchez. Albies, Agrizal rookie. Not familiar with some of these rookies because uh, they weren't in series one. So this is Emmanuel Clace, Clace, Emmanuel Clace for the Indians. Brozo rookie. A no-name variation, and that's going to be a throwback uniform of Tim Anderson. I don't know if the variations run into each other, as in, like, throwback uniform and no-name. Yeah, Buster Posey, Freed, and Edmund. Guriel, uh, Moran, Calhoun, we got a blue parallel coming up, Molina, and it's going to be an Agrizal rookie, and that is going to be numbered to 250, so the blues are to 250, nice that it's a rookie. Alright, those are the ones we went through. Then we got Fraley, Mondesi, and Dubon rookie. A little bit over halfway done with the box. Alcantara, Gratterall rookie. 
Loriano Davies. And our second auto is going to be Dylan Cease. That is a rookie card. Pitcher for the White Sox. So no huge autos out of that box. That's okay. Freeman and a Duggar rookie. I guess we're still looking for the um, the base of Jordan, Sean Murphy rookie, Strasburg. Solaire. All right, so that is a natural. That was just a regular Tim Anderson with no name on it that I got because that is the base and it is he's just wearing his throwbacks uh, McNeil Dietrich Vets Seeger and Will Smith Stroman Torres Woodruff France Keston here, a fortune teller. Garver, Trey Turner, and Ramirez. Justin Turner. Austin Riley. Jake Rogers, rookie. Zach Gallen, rookie. Lopez, rookie. And Bogarts. Nico Horner, rookie. That's a good one. Juan Soto. Trent Grisham. Yep. A rookie card. A fortune teller of Austin Meadows. Ryan O'Hearn, Trevor Story, and Miguel Cabrera. I'm going to have to, after this video is over, I'll take a look at a, uh, all the cards again and see if I missed anything. Paul DeJong, Nunez rookie, Flaherty, Rowdy Tellez, and we got a red, Sonny Gray, Mitch Hanninger, and Dowell Lugo, and our red is going to be Araldis Chapman, and that is number to 10. Holy crap. So Red Chapman to 10. Last three packs. Senzel, Savali, rookie. Machado, Gregorius. Wheel of Fortune, Javi Baez. We got a Gary Hampson, Garcia, rookie. And Carter Kaboom. John Lester, Clayton Kershaw, Chan Sisko, Nick Solak, rookie, Javi Baez, James Paxton, Brandon Belt, and Soroka. Cedric Mullins, Lopez, Altuve, Eloy, Gurriel Jr., Ravello, rookie, Smith and Rodriguez in our last pack. Mancata, Brantley, Kyle Lewis rookie. That's a good one. Justin Smoke. Wheel of Fortune Acuna. I like that card. Arnado Chang rookie. And Eddie Rosario. All right, let's take a quick look at what we got out of box number one. 
a bunch of rookies, like a whole fat stack of rookies here. This is Nico. Can't wait to see how these guys do. Hopefully they get to play sometime this year. Alzale. Just um oh look, the Al this is a Alzale variation with the uh I don't know what that is in the corner. But that is definitely a variation. I have an unlimited supply of Alzale. <laughs> He's like the guy that I keep on pulling this year. Brown. Anthony K rookie. As far as inserts go, we got the uh, Wheel of Fortune Acuna Jr. Javi Baez Wheel of Fortune. Uh, for our fortune tellers, we got Austin Meadows, Keston Hira, Michael Chavis, and Paul DeJong. And a Mike Trout base. Always take out my Trouts. Cards I sleeved already. Would be this Elzele variation. Araldus Chapman to 10. Uh, that's a pretty tough card to pull there. Dylan Cease, auto, rookie. And Agrizal to 250, blue. That is 250, right? Yep, 250. A no name, and that is Tim Anderson. Gavin Lux, rookie. Clemente, short print, one per box. Austin Meadows, um, not rookie, but auto, uh, could have done a little bit better there. An Aquino rookie, Bichette rookie, and an Alvarez, the world. And, uh, that's a Tarot of the Diamond card. So that is very cool. Are these, what are these called? All right. So I don't understand. Tarot of the Diamond. All right, so underneath the other tarot of the diamond, it says Wheel of Fortune, Wheel of Fortune. But this one says The World. So I have to take a look at that one a little closer when I am finished. Oh, we got this Louis Robert, Louis Robert, uh, rookie card. I like that one a lot. Out of Inception, we did awesome. <laughs> it was a way to start the day. Uh, Willie Castro, green variation, and a Robel Garcia, pink, out of 99. And we got Devers, Paddock, and a Thice rookie card. But we did get two hits in that box. Uh, a Yamamoto jersey sticker auto, pink, to 75. And a Vladimir Guerrero Jr. to 75 auto. And the Vladdy is on card. I like that one a lot. So that does it for box number one. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. I will be right back with box number two. Hopefully you get a little bit better autos out of box number two. Um, we'll see how that goes. Oh, crap. Look at this. You thought I was wrapping up. Nope. We got some chrome left to do. Bonus packs. Got to love the bonus packs. All right. Oh, we're going to start right off with the numbered card. And it's going to be Eduardo Escobar to 150. Wow. I like the chrome design on these. It's, it's really nice. Um, Chris Davis and Clayton Kershaw. So that does it for box one of Gypsy Queen. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you guys think. Um, it's a relatively cheap product. I can get more of it. So, oh, look at this card. Bam. Free roll of toilet paper with every purchase. Can't beat that. All right, guys. I will see you in a little bit. Have a good one. Stay safe. Stay, uh, wash your hands and don't touch your face and all that kind of stuff. So, I will talk to you later. Bye.